What's up? My name is Technoba here for Troubleshoot and in today's super quick video, I'm going to go through enabling or disabling online and offline notifications as well as a bunch of other social notifications from major game platforms being Steam, Origin, Uplay, Blizzard and the Epic Games Store, even though that last one I don't think has online or offline notifications, but I'm going to be going through them in this video today. Of course, to skip to the platform of choice, simply click the play bar down below or check the description for timestamps. So let's start with Steam. So first open up Steam, then open up your friends list and then click the settings button under your username. Once in this screen, head to notifications and then we have this over here. The one that we're looking for is when a friend comes online. Simply uncheck show a notification and you won't get this annoying pop-up, especially if you have tons of friends. Of course, you can adjust the rest of the notification settings here as well. Next up on the list, we have Origin. Once you have the Origin client open, in the very top left, click Origin, then Application Settings. Then at the very top, head across to Notifications, and over here is where we have what we're looking for. We have Notification Options, as well as Sound Options. Under Friend Activity, I'll disable Friend Signs In, Signs Out, Starts game, quits game, broadcasting, stops broadcasting, and I'll also disable the sounds over here. Unfortunately, there isn't a disable all button. You'll have to go through and disable them all manually if you'd like to do that. Next up, we have Uplay. Simply open up the Uplay launcher, click the hamburger option button in the top left, and head across to settings. Then find the notifications tab over here, and we have all of our options over here. So I'll be turning off when a friend comes online and when a friend launches a game. Of course, you can disable or re-enable any of these other options over here. There is a nice option up here to enable or disable desktop notifications entirely or only have them in-game, which is a really nice feature. Next up on our list, we have Blizzard. Inside of the Blizzard launcher, simply click the Blizzard text in the top left and head across to Settings. Then find the Sound and Notifications tab and over here we have all of the options. We can go ahead and turn on or off these as we see fit. Note that a toast notification is the one that pops up in the bottom right. Why is it called toast? Well, because it pops out of your tray and then disappears back into it, much like toast popping out and back into a toaster. So I'll disable when a friend comes online, goes offline, starts a game, and of course I'll be turning off the sound for these as well. We can also disable or re-enable any of these ones down below as well but I'll leave them as is. Then finally, we have the Epic Games Launcher. While I don't think you get online or offline notifications, you do get some notifications. How exactly do you adjust those settings? Well, simply open up the friends list by clicking the friends text. Then click the social settings button, and inside of here, we have a bunch of options, though we have this one checkbox over here, which is show notifications. There's not much more customization past that, but I'm not exactly sure if there is any notifications for Epic Games, though that is the one and only notifications option that I'm aware of. Anyways, hopefully this quick video helped you get where you want it to be. My name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!